Well, Eduardo, if we're talking about classic wine regions, we have to talk about Piedmont and Barolo. Absolutely. So to illustrate this in the glass, we have the 2016 vintage of the Carlin de Paolo Barolo. So um, Piedmont, as you know, um, we're in the northwestern part of Italy. It's at the the foothills of the Alps. That's what the name means. Uh, Piemonte means in the foot of the mountain, if you will. Exactly. So, yeah. The climatic features, the geographical Tortonian and Helvetian soils, all these things play put the best pedestal for this this wine and this varietal yes. and what they represent. And when we talk about Barolo, of course, we're talking really Nebbiolo, which is the the, Absolutely. the king there. And Barolo is always going to be a hundred percent Nebbiolo of that one variety, mm -hmm. and it's a very um, it's a very difficult variety to Picky, grow. Picky, finicky, thin skinned. Yes. That benefits from the nebbia, or that's where it grows nebbia, meaning the fog right. or the, the cloudy right. kind of components. Nebbia, and, so nebbiolo, right? Absolutely. Yeah. Um, but And it has to be grown on hillsides, I think, by law. Absolutely. In, in the region. Um, and But I think in the glass, we're going we're gonna to understand exactly why people would want to put up with this finicky variety, right? Absolutely. Because it's just, it's just an extraordinary variety in terms of many, many qualities. So, I mean, I think looking at it right away, you know, you have this kind of, you know, garnet tone to it. Mm -hmm. um, it can be deceptive because I think a lot of times when we think about grape varieties that are very tannic, um, they look dark in color. Yeah, you do expect that inkiness to it, right. but it, this is the, the complete opposite, Ex much like reflects like burgundy in the glass, right? In exactly, some way. Exactly, exactly. You've got that sort of paler color, but in the in the glass, it's going to have high tannins. It also has high acidity mm -hmm. as well. Um, and you know, the tannin, I mean, I, I'm a very straightforward taster. I just taste them right across like sort of the center of my tongue, but I know some mm -hmm. people experience it sort of at the front of the mouth here, but it's that real drying sensation. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. It's like eating walnuts in some way. Um, this wine, it's, it's, it, it really portrays that. It's mm -hmm. got mm -hmm. the nose. I love this. Like it's a mix between like dried tobacco, orange, asphalt, yes. strawberries. There's there's a lot going on there. Cinnamon when, stick. Exactly. When I was first learning about Nebbiolo, people would describe it as um, you know tar and roses in the glass, right? Mm -hmm. And it kind of that that cherry, but it's almost like a bit of a tart cherry, right? Uh huh. Absolutely. Yeah. And it's it's just very mouth watering, and that combined with as you mentioned the acidity and the tannin, yeah. it's just a huge orchestra in the palate and the way it delivers. Yes. Amazing. I mean, we're talking regional pairings with some. White truffles from Adla. Truffles, Adela. yes. I can't even say that my mouth's watering, but you grab just a little pasta, butter, mm -hmm. uh, olive oil, and just the truffles on top. And this wine, there is no better connection of two worlds, I believe, in, in my brain. Just stars align. <laughs> it's amazing. Um, a, a very moving component there. But, Absolutely. Uh, yeah, I mean, and this, this is, is a small producer, right? A small family-owned producer. Absolutely. Um, it, it it did spend some time in, of course, in barrel. So, um, mm -hmm. uh, eighteen months in barrel and two years in bottle before it was released. Mm -hmm. um, but still, so young, right? So fresh, and the tannins are they'll resolve over time. But it's Nebbiolo, so they're always going to be pretty high. Absolutely. I mean, this 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 wines. You're talking 10, 20 years, no problem. Exactly. I mean, amazing now, but also has that longevity that you can rely on as, if, a, as a producing If you region. have patience, but I don't know, this is so delicious. I don't know that I could wait. I know, it's too tasty. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. <laughs>